And we are back. Hello, hello. And it's time to go to Vesper. It is that place. And we are on it. Time to scan stuff. This place is neat music. VDO, Vesper Defense Outpost, is situated on the outer edge of Olympic Territory, serving as a refueling station and munitions dump. Sub-zero temperature is maintained to prevent overheating of fusion-powered weapon systems. Structural failure of fuel canisters has resulted in a vast radioactive spill into space, leaving toxic and explosive fuel frozen to the sides of the structure. So this place isn't exactly icy, but actually you do slip on this. So I guess it is icy. But we have a legit ice world coming up right after this, so this is just like a pseudo icy world. Also, mirror into space. There is nothing to scan in this big old room. This big old room is actually a stage of multiplayer. Many of them are. I actually don't like the stage very much in multiplayer because it is very easy to get sniped. Also, the portals are located up here. Still nothing to scan. Alright. we. Where's our doorway? A... Where's our doorway? Is it above me? I'm looking right at it. Duh. Olympic Prophecy 03. Yellow lightning shall strike with demonic fury upon the Greenwood. Another hint. Big old room full of these guys. Blow them up. You don't have to, but it'll make scanning stuff easier. These are all small missiles, I would seem. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I just ate that. There it is. Hard to see the little box. Fuel rod. Powers nearby weaponry chambers. Easy enough. Mixing tanks. Used to synthesize poisonous gases. Trace amounts of toxic materials detected. Clone engine. Excuse me. Severe deterioration of microcircuitry detected. Systems non-functional. Oh, I want to clone some stuff. Get some space sheep going on in here. Lab equipment. Used to grow bioweaponry. Seems inoperative. Good, because we all know bioweapons don't get you anywhere. Spore farm. A controlled environment used to grow toxic spores. The spores have expired. Poor things. Well, they're toxic spores, so I assume they would be bad for us. Am I the only one who thinks that mushrooms are really cute? Just a random fact of the day thing. Ew. Yes, you can scan the floor. Frozen fuel line. Pipe shows signs of structural failure. You slip across it. Hey, new turret. And it's shooting at me. Olympic turret V1.4. This modified turret is capable of firing rapid-fire operation with little or no overheating. That actually makes it the second most dangerous turret in the game, in my opinion. Luckily, there's like none of them. Or perhaps unluckily for those who would like to see more of that. Oh, I hate that cat so much. She's scratching at the door even though I just let her in. Also, I've already scanned you guys. No reason to do it again. I see a green blush tube. What am I doing? Green force field. 
Analysis indicates the force field is impervious to most weapons. A heavy duty weapon may damage its guard node. Are you seeing a pattern? There should be data shades in here. I saw one. There's another one. History 03. The peace of Alim oh, ancient Alimbic tribal culture was shattered by a deadly extraterrestrial invasion. The survivors vowed never again to be caught unprepared. History 4. We focused our resources on military science and quickly developed weapons and defenses that surpassed the technology of our enemies. That's probably History 2. Nope. Octolith Safeguard. Beware our guardians. These deadly sentinels travel in packs and are programmed to protect that which is dear to us. Whee. Also, things. Two things. Ithrax, or whatever they're called. Hear them roar. They're very good creatures, are you? Just kind of run forward and hop. I see a boss thing on the radar. Is there anything to scan in here? Nope. In my key. Key. Into the hole once again. Go, go, go. There is an E tank in this room, if I remember right, or possibly just a missile. I forget which. Yeah, missile. Don't get hit by the green beam. Green beam will ream you. And here's the one instance in the game where you have to morph ball jump. It works exactly the same as it does in Metroid Prime. Not very hard. Uh, which way do we want to go first? I totally forget. Ow, ow, ow. Also, don't do what I told you not to do, because that happens. It actually kind of hurts. Go. Open. Open. Go. Door. Open. Not sure if we wanted to be up here first. We're down there first. There's the boss portal. Wait. Stronghold portal. I guess you have to scan them when they're not uh, operational, too. History 7. Our protective exoskeletons enabled us to survive the environmental extremes of the Olympic home Olympic home world. Not Olympic. There's a thing. What's that? No, oh, the force field. Uh, this was not the right way to go. Back the way we came. Through more doors that take a while to load. Metroid doors have to load open. It's okay. Doesn't take very long to traverse this place. Wee. I did that totally the wrong way. Also, really creepy thing. I'm just gonna avoid it. Ooh, this room looks cool. And, you know, another creepy thing. Nothing wrong with creepy things. <gasps> We're locked in. That's not good. There's a thing, there's a thing. There's some more things. Ooh, we can scan that. The cortex chamber controls the entire neural assemble by processing input from the thalamic coil. And there's a bunch of spectral locks. What are these for? What are you keeping in here? It should be incredibly obvious what they're keeping in here, but hey, suspense. And we activate whatever that is. Oh, that's icky. Uh, we found a green thing. That is, in fact, the battle hammer.
Battle hammer found. You've obtained the battle hammer, powered by miniature nuclear reactor. This heavy-duty repeater is recommended only for those familiar with high-caliber weaponry. And now, we got a new gun. And our weapon changes color when we switch. Also, it's added to the bottom screen, right there. That's something I'll be using too often. Let's get away from the creepy thing. Me. No, I don't want to go back up. Blow up the weird thing. Stop chasing me, weird thing. Open. 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 Thank you. Things! Ooh, new things. Those can freeze me if I let them hit me. Psychobit V 4.0. Cryogenic nanite technology enables this advanced sentry droid to freeze its prey with super cooled plasma. Let's try out a new toy. Ah, I've been frozen. They make funny noises when you hit them. Also, there's a thingy. Looks kind of like an E-tank, but not really. What is it? No. Can't scan it because there's a thing in my way. How do we get rid of the thing? Well, the fire. But how do we get rid of the force field? We should probably scan around and find out. Or do I want to be up there now? Aha. Okay. Doing is out of order once again. Forgive my lack of practice. Yep, 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 here's the thing, here's the thing. Kill the thing. Hey, health! It was worth it after all. I don't want to go that way. Boom. I missed! No! It's going to leave without me, but we made it, so it's okay. Also, Rocket Knight Adventures had a sequel on the Genesis, and I tried it out, and it's not that great. It had some potential for sure. I'm playing it, and I'm thinking this could have been a really good game, but they just throw so much BS at you, and the game doesn't really have the controls to deal with all the crap it throws at you. Also, so many green enemies. And we don't have the Volt Driver to deal with them. It's okay though, because they're. Oh, I didn't even see the spawner. Spawner duos. I think the power beam is pretty good in its own right. There's just some enemies that it takes far too long to destroy. But by that point, we'll have much better weapons to deal with them. Ah, yes. The ammo for multiplayer. Small UA pack. Replenishes 10 rounds of universal ammo. Morphing UA. Contains mun Morphing UA contains munitions nanotechnology engineered for instant adaption to almost any weapon, altering caliber and composition at the molecular level to match the ballistic specifications of the host weapon. Long story short, you can use the ammo for all weapons. Which is, you know, nice. Uh, hey, you know the big thing. Let's scan it. History 6. To defend our territories from extraterrestrial attack, we deployed lethal bioweaponry. So it's like, good bioweapons, kinda. And there's one up there, let's scan it. Olympic War 10. If you are reading this message, our plan to contain Goria was a success. Honor our sacrifice and do not seek this thing. Only harm can come from such a course. I'm sure that has no importance to our uh, campaign here. Why don't you get a scanning room? First floor column force fields unlocked. Now we can slip down there. I can grab that thing. I want that thing. And... Force field switch. Central force forward. Force field unlocked. They still make us go the long way though. Jerks. Alright. Now is when we go down there. 
This video could be so much shorter if I didn't have all this backtracking to do. Oh well. Doesn't matter too much. Unless you're really, really bugged by that kind of thing, but... Ow. A little bug that we ran over. That thing creeps me out when you're in biped mode and it jumps on you. So it like latches onto your face like a leech and just starts sucking on you. It depletes your energy actually pretty quickly. Also, thing. UA expansion increases the universal ammo capacity by 30 units. Right now we have, I think, I believe 40. Let's find out. It also replenishes your ammo, so let's find out. Yeah, we had 40, now we have 70. I hear tons of angry things. Where are you going? It still takes so long to kill things. Not that great of a weapon, but that gets the job done. And that gets rid of all these forest fields. Even the roof ones? No, still not the roof ones. I know those eventually go away. Ah, that might be what we're doing right in here. I totally didn't check for a, uh... One of these guys. History 08. Our enlarged forebrains facilitated enhanced cognitive function. It was our ability to think quickly that saved us from early and violent extinction. So they had huge heads. Dr. Membrane. I wonder if they were like monkeys. Hmm. Guardians. Guardians, I use the Volt Driver. That should mean they're weak to this. If I could only aim it. Also, just a single Guardian. Get back here, dude. Ooh, the turret is back. The turret is back. The turret's shooting the guardian. <laughs> Some great technology you guys have there. We are still missing a key. Also. Let's look around for stuff to scan. Ah, and this is that a shade. History 05. We were a peaceful people, but we defended our homeworld with a fierce determination. We wouldn't. Don't push me off, don't push me off. Uh, he's pushing me around. I should just missile you, but I'm too lazy. Okay. Ooh. What's in my box? UA. Do do do. Is there anything in here? Is there anything in here? I did miss a data shade, knew it. Obulite 08. Only the Olympic Cannon can access the Infinity Void. Hmm. Once again, I'm sure that's not important to our mission at all. Did I miss something very obvious? Where's the last key? Ah, duh. I remember now. Back we go. There's the door. Open, open, open. Open up. Come on. Open up. Do -do -do -do. And actually, since this video is getting a bit long, I'm going to cut it here and we will be right back. One moment.